Lesson 9.2, Describe Circles. We describe a circle as a flat shape that is round and curved. We explain open and closed shapes. Here we have a big orange circle. We can use our finger to trace around this circle. We can start anywhere as long as we finish where we started. We can start here and we go all the way around and back to where we started. And the edge of the circle is not straight. It's got a curve. Circles are round and curved and flat. Here we have a circle. A circle is round, curved, and flat. A ball is not flat. I have a blue ball here. This is not flat because it's taking up space. I can hold it in my hand like this. A real ball takes up space. In real life, a ball is a sphere. But a flat picture of a ball looks like a circle. And we'll talk about spheres in chapter 10, our next chapter. Here we have some clocks. Clocks are made in many different shapes and sizes. Which of these clocks is in the shape of a circle? Do you know? If you said this one, you're right. This one is in the shape of a triangle. We can see it has three sides. This one is in the shape of a square. It has one, two, three, four sides. And this one is in the shape of a circle. It has curves as it goes around. Here we have part of a cookie. We need to finish drawing the cookie by completing the circle shape. We can see there's only part of the cookie. We can start right here and do our best to curve around and complete the cookie. We made it into a circle. We finished the circle. We made a curved line to finish the cookie. Here we have some dot paper. We can take some tie twists from a loaf of bread and tie it around the bottom of a pencil like this. And we can choose a dot and we can hold our finger on that point and we can make a circle by going around. We got to make sure our finger stays on that dot as we go around. Try using my thumb, see if that holds it good. And we can go around, we can make a circle. Now as you get older, there's a tool that does this, it's called a compass. And you put this point in the center, like this, and there's a pencil on this side, and if we keep the point here, we can spin this around, and it will draw a circle going all the way around. It's the same idea. We have a pencil, and we're going around a point. We can also do it with two pencils with a paper clip between them to hold it stiff. There are closed shapes and open shapes. These are closed shapes. If we were inside, we wouldn't be able to get out. There's no opening. So if this was a fence, we wouldn't be able to get out if it was a tall fence. And these are open shapes. We can see there's an opening. If we were inside, we would be able to get out. We'd be able to walk out of the opening. These are closed shapes. These are open shapes. So remember, a circle is round, curved, and flat. And remember, there are closed shapes and open shapes. In our next lesson, 9.3, we're going to identify and name squares. I hope you'll join me. I hope you have a really nice day, and I hope you hit the like button. Bye.